Arts welcomes you to Eats and Beats, the precursor to this, week, this year's restaurant week. We've teamed up with some local restaurant owners and York musicians to give you a little something to watch while you enjoy tonight's meal. So sit back, pick up your forks, and get ready to get excited about what's to come and why this year's event is more important than ever. Restaurant Week York, February 19th through 28th. So I guess that I'll just stay. Robert Godfrey, owner of the Handsome Cap. Hey, I'm Tony Calderon from Two Tony's Restaurant in downtown York. David Albright, Rockfish Public House. Uh, Jared Barnes, Collusion Tap Works. My name is Philip Given with York City Pretzel Company. My name's Jessica Ayala, and I'm from Revival Social Club. Through the hard times, you were made to be my girl. Go, but still be mine. I will try. Until then, I can't move, I can't run from myself, from my thoughts. Out of making love to the girl I call boy. Now it stings inside my skull. Can't you hold your breath as long as you let me on? I can feel your heart is cold. Uh, so for us at Collusion for Restaurant Week this year, uh, we've decided to offer a little package for the Eats and Beats uh, for the day before, a little party going on. And we're going to be doing three different crowler offerings. Uh, what we're serving is a, a tuna pokey. Uh, it's a raw tuna dish that uh, it's really special to me. It's one of my favorite things on the menu because it's a Hawaiian dish. My parents retired on Hawaii. I've been there many times. So the rendition of the dish is uh, kind of a Maui marinade. It's served with wonton crisp. There's sesame, soy. There's uh, scallions, a little hot pepper for spice, seaweed salad, sriracha, and wasabi aioli. It's cauliflower, pecorino cheese, agnolotti, which is a handmade like little pouch of pasta. And uh, it's going to be in a thyme rosemary butter sauce. So we'll be serving the entree portion of the dish, which is the braised short rib with a honey glazed carrot silk, and then a beet and horseradish gremolata. So the Handsome Cab is uh, serving wines. For the fundraiser, we've chosen about 10 to 15 wines that can accompany your dinner, uh, and we have something available for anyone at very reasonable prices. Uh, so we will be providing pretzel nuggets, which will be turned into a delicious pretzel bread pudding with salted caramel dip by Revival of Social Club. It's gonna be the day that they're gonna throw it back to you By now, they should have somehow realized what you gotta do 2020 was certainly an interesting year. I think that York City Pretzel Company, like other restaurants, had to learn how to adapt and pivot. Um, especially since the bulk of our business is wholesale, so we sell to other restaurants and bars. Um, if they are struggling, we are struggling, essentially. One thing that we did was uh, start online sales, so we ship our pretzels across the country now, which has been um, a, a learning experience, but in the end, a really great experience for our company. Uh, that being said, we are looking forward to somewhat of a return to normalcy, and, and as our restaurant partners become more successful, we'll get busier, and I think things will start to get back to normal. Pivoting was a word that um, I picked up when I was a point guard in basketball, so it's like what we do. Um, so pivoting has been our nature in this beast right now. Uh, we went to the Rigatoni food truck. We were selling pasta door to door, which was the most fun for the team. Totally out of our, our uh, element, but we had so much fun doing it. People were literally running out of their houses like the ice cream truck was coming. And we just provided a little bit of entertainment in, a, in trying time. And then, I don't know if you've heard about it, but Presto opened up. So we are the first drive through pasta concept in York County, which is pretty cool. So it's quick pasta at Build Your Own. We have a location in Central Market. We have a location that just opened up in West York, which was the old Brewsters in front of Lowe's. And then uh, we're opening up in East York. So 
Pasta is our game. We do it well. We love it. We love serving our community, and we just found different ways to do it. However, it has been trying. It has been exhausting. It has been defeating. It's been all the things. Open, close, open, close, because we also have Canteen and Avianos. So this team, behind the scenes, of my face that puts on the show, we need Restaurant Week more than you know. The camaraderie downtown of all the different local restaurant owners. We all put our whole heart and soul into everything that we do. So coming together to serve you one cool event at a time is what we live for. And we really hope that you guys show up as you have been through this pandemic. So it's you guys that keep us doing all the crazy things. So thank you. Cheers. Well, certainly since March, this is unprecedented. The restaurant industry getting shut down. Uh, certainly our livelihoods, uh, our staff's livelihoods have been greatly affected. Uh, when we were allowed to open, it first started to go, so that's how the governor lifted restrictions. Then we were open as a group uh, for our limited capacity. When it went back to 25% for Rockfish and the White, Rest uh, White Rose Restaurant Group, we decided that uh, we need to take a step back and reorganize, restructure. We were such a big organization and to just do minimal amount of business, we did not want to uh, you know, hurt staff without getting unemployment and not enough hours for everybody. So we took a step back before reopening in November. year we've learned a lot we've grown a lot we've had more challenges than than usual it, it's been definitely the year of learning and trying to figure things out day by day and what what we can do differently what we can do better it's been helpful and it's taught us um, how to adapt and and how to learn and grow which has been a super positive but of course it has made many things much harder this year life during COVID for the pandemic uh, as a brewery owner and uh, restaurant owner has been uh, pretty up and down for us uh, over the past nine months. It's definitely been difficult with the lack of indoor dining. To go sales have been good. The community support has been great. Uh, a lot of our customers have really stepped up and you know have supported us and our bartenders and our kitchen staff throughout this whole thing. Yeah, so it, it's it's been a roller coaster for sure. Um, we've been doing a lot of virtual wine tastings. We've been doing some in-person dinners as socially distanced as well as um, virtual. We added selling wine by the bottle um, that uh, allows us to sell our inventory but also give people another place to buy things that they can't get anywhere else. We have access to wines that a lot of other people, uh, including the, the fine wine and good spirit stores, do not have access to. The summer we did dining in the street, which was a great option, and we have full plans to continue that and expand it within the city um, to create a uh, dining tourism type model. We were kind of the uh, guinea pig for for that model this past summer, and it went very well. But as soon as cold set in around November, um, sales really plummeted. At White Rose Restaurant Group, we had 312 employees, and we were we are probably lower than 30 employees right now. Ten. We have ten. <laughs> yeah, we um, obviously during the initial shutdown, um, when when most businesses were completely shut down, we we laid off most of our staff. We were um, happy to be able to bring them back. Um, obviously thanks to support that we got in the community, but uh, the online shipping. So not only have we br brought employees back, but we've actually had to hire more employees to fulfill that need, which is something we're really proud of. We have, we, in November, we had to lay off half of our staff, and then when we had the mandate to close, everyone got laid off, and we're planning to reopen uh, for dining in service on February 4th. I don't berate anybody for the decisions they've had to make over this whole thing. It's something none of us have ever had to deal with. 
and people are doing the best that they can. Yes, uh, we have kept all of our employees on uh, since the beginning um, through either partial unemployment uh, or we ended, ended up actually paying out and trying to make up some uh, missed hours uh, for employees to make sure that they still could maintain their, their 35, 40 hours a week worth of work. So we have not had to lay anybody off or fire anybody uh, full time through this whole endeavor. Well, it's more important than ever because the restaurants really need everyone's help. Um, everyone, in order to survive this year, needs a big boost. Um, you know, we hope to get over this by, you know, summer um, to a point of some type of normalcy. But um, the restaurants have been decimated um, throughout the last year. And the ones that are surviving really need your help to make it through the next few months. We're actually going to do a, uh, a little survey uh, and have the community tell us what they would like to see us do for Restaurant Week. Seeing the York community support restaurants uh, is what Restaurant Week has really always been about. I think that that will be more important now than it ever has been. But also I think that um, some restaurants and certainly a, a lot of the customers have really just been disconnected over the last year. So it'll be nice to reconnect with customers and expose them to our product again. Um, and that sense of community with the restaurant group has really been a shared misery uh, over the last year. Um, it will be good to come together for something positive again. And it's, it's really important that people understand that the local restaurants and bars are the ones that really need your support right now. I mean, we've, you've, you've, the McDonald's are going to be fine. The Chick-fil-A, as delicious as it is, is going to be fine. The Smoky Bones is going to be fine. You know, it's, it's the mom and pop shops that are really hurting right now. So any support that we can give to that and to allow, um, you know, those restaurants to showcase something that, you know, they can bring to the table uh, to, to help them out is, is really important. The best people are the ones that will go to a different restaurant every day uh, and, and check out new places, and it, it really gives you uh, a way to experience new things uh, on a you know on a modest budget of you know the five dollar, ten dollar, fifteen dollar offerings, which is really great. Thirty dollar offerings for you know course down meals is great. So I mean, just just in the aspect that you get to try new things that you might not have tried before, and you know can then continue to support those businesses. Once you've learned, oh man, I can get some really great Indian food at Hamir's or some awesome stuff down at World Grills. Or make sure, make sure you come out for Restaurant Week and show your support to all the people that have, you know, stuck with it through the thick and thin. And, you know, this week I know a lot of people are counting on and, and can really make or break some places. You know, this is this is you know hopefully coming close to the end of a pretty crazy era, and, and any sort of support that anybody can give would be well appreciated. Restaurant Week is huge this year. It's 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 huge to support and, and remember that the small businesses that have, you know, given back to the community for so long and given so many things back as well um, are supported also because they, they've been through a lot of challenges and been through a lot of, of heartaches and ups and downs this year. Driving down south Restaurant Week, uh, I think it's a chance to uh, really help support the restaurants. The restaurants need the, the business. Uh, I think it's great for the community. Every year, I think the culinary scene uh, becomes more diversified. Uh, there's all different uh, ethnic foods. Uh, there's a lot of different offerings, and I think that's a great chance to show your county and beyond what York City is all about and what the, the culinary scene that we've created downtown. Certainly, I think all the restaurants, they're, we're excited uh, to, to be busy. You know, we're ready. That's what our normal lives are, busy restaurant tours and restaurant employees. So we're, we're ramped up for this. I expect a lot from our community, and our community has taught me to expect a lot from them because they always come through. So, um, yeah, I, w I would expect that it would have a good turnout because there's a lot of giving hearts right now. And at the end of the day, you're not helping us out. Your place is going to be open when you're ready to go back out and eat. Like, 
we're just trying to survive our business, but you're going to be the one enjoying it at the end of the day, so you better make sure it's a way it can unlive by the time this is over. The restaurant industry has been at the forefront of a lot of conversation lately, which is really cool for us because people really don't understand how much is involved in running a restaurant. So the fact that it's so much in the spotlight and it really does take a community to hold one up, I think it's cool that the takeaway is it takes a village. It takes a village. Even though you go there and you have your birthday celebrations or your, your uh, drink after work, that's your space. It's your place. So it's really cool to see the restaurants in the spotlight that otherwise wouldn't have existed prior to this. So I like to always try to look at the straight side of things. Should I go down? 
If I stay too long in trouble town Oh, yeah You wreck me, baby Yeah, you break me in two Will you move me, honey? Oh, yes, you do Now and again I get the feeling Well, if I don't win I'm gonna break even Rescue me Should I go wrong If I dig too deep If I stay too long Oh Yeah Will you wreck me, baby? Yeah, you bring me in two Will you move me, honey? Oh, yes, you do boy in the corduroy pants and you'll be the girl at the high school dance run with me wherever I go and just play dumb whatever you know oh yeah Will you wreck me baby yeah, you break me in two Will you move me, honey? Oh, yes, you do Will you wreck me, baby? Yeah, you break me in two Will you move me, honey? Oh, yes, you do So many nights I spent crying alone, wishing you were here. We made up this house all for ourselves, but now it's just me. You stopped in one last time, but I thought you'd stay. Left your key and went away. If you think that I hate you or think that I'm mad, you should feel it all. But if you think that I love you and miss you so bad, it's true. I do. Just tell me you loved me at least I keep thinking back to Colorado The snow-tipped mountains You said we would move there I loved it so much Now I guess I'll go alone I saw you today But 
When I turn the corner, you melted away. If you think that I hate you or think that I'm mad, you should feel it all. But if you think that I love you and miss you so bad, it's true. I do. And I know that you moved on Or act like you did But if you ever loved me Even just a bit You tell me You're sorry at least Just tell me You love me
lose it all Wanna lock in your lungs Locking you along, baby Now I got you in my space Won't let go of you Got you shackled in nothing, baby I'm latching on to you Now I
like strawberries on a summer evening and it sounds just like a song I want more berries and the summer feeling it's so wonderful and warm breathe me in breathe me out I don't know if I could ever go without I'm just thinking out loud I don't know if I could ever go without Watermelon sugar high Watermelon sugar high Watermelon sugar high Watermelon sugar high Strawberries on a summer evening Baby, you're the end of June I want your belly and a summer feeling Getting washed away in you Breathe me in, breathe me out I don't know if I could ever go without I'm just thinking out loud I don't know if I could ever go without Watermelon sugar high Watermelon sugar high Watermelon sugar high Watermelon sugar high I just wanna taste it I just wanna taste it Watermelon sugar high I just wanna taste it I just want to taste it Watermelon sugar high Tastes like strawberries On a summer evening And it sounds just like a song I want your belly And the summer feeling I don't know if I could ever go without Watermelon sugar high 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 Watermelon sugar Dance when you're drunk with your friends at a party. What's your favorite song? Does it make you smile? Do you think of me? When you close your eyes, tell me what are you dreaming? Everything I want to know it all. I'd spend 10,000 hours and 10,000 more. Oh, if that's what it takes to learn that sweetheart of yours. And I might never get there, but I'm gonna try If it's 10,000 hours or the rest of my life I'm gonna love you Ooh. Do you miss the road that you grew up on? Did you get your middle name from your grandma? When you think about your forever now, do you think of me? When you close your eyes, tell me what are you dreaming? Everything I 
want to know it all I'd spend 10,000 hours and 10,000 more Oh, if that's what it takes to learn that sweetheart of yours And I might never get there, but I'm gonna try If it's 10,000 hours or the rest of my life curiosity I'd spend 10,000 hours and 10,000 more oh if that's what it takes to learn that sweetheart of yours and I might never get there but I'm gonna try if it's 10,000 hours all the rest of my life I'm gonna love you too much to say it and I don't know how to fix it we've been broken for so long we're addicted to the pain baby I know we can work this all out I love you I know it without a doubt but you need to find yourself and I need to fix my health and we need to come to I know I want to fix it We've been broken for so long We're addicted to the pain Baby, I know we can work this all out I love you, I know it without a doubt But you need to find yourself And I need to fix my health Then we need to come to
I think we found something 
Atlantic, I cross the Atlantic for them. Thinking about it all day, you know what I want. The second the minute I call this ooh, yeah, that's the only music that I wanna hear. Is ooh, get a little louder, screaming in my ear.
you see, it's not me, it's not my family. In your head, in your head, they are fighting with their tanks and their bombs and their bombs and their guns. In your head, in your head, they are crying. Silence, we must be mistaken. It's the same old theme since 1916. In your head, in your head, they're still fighting with their tanks and their bombs and their bombs and their guns. In your head, in your head, they are dying. Thank you.
Hey mama, how do you get a red wine stain out of your fever dress? Black mascara off a pillowcase, cure one too many headache. And mama, can I come and maybe stay a few days this weekend and next? And hey, how do you get a red wine stain out of your fever dress? How does he sleep at night? Mama, the nerve of this guy to leave me so easy. Am I gonna be alright? I wanna kick myself a phone so hard. Mama, can you die from a broken heart? You ask daddy if he's got time to come and look at my front door It got slammed last night And now it don't close your right. And just promise that you won't tell him everything And keep that pistol in the drawer And mama please don't say You're gonna laugh about this someday You didn't see the way you drove away How does he sleep at night? Mama, the nerve of this guy to leave me so easy. Am I gonna be alright? I wanna kick myself a phone so hard. Mama, can you die from a broken down the sun is too all we see are stars and the moon wait i'll always where i tend to go keep me high keep me high empty roads are blowing on through singing songs we always do i never get tired of them or you keep me high keep me high and we sing you to go promise you'll stay with me stay with me stay by my side make me laugh until I cry until the sunrise until the But we're out of our minds Wonder why we do this every time Take my hands, I'll draw the lines And let you feel what only we can see The sky is changing many colors But it'll never be as beautiful as what I see In the passenger seat, baby Keep me high And we sing, oh, I don't want you to go Promise you'll stay with me, stay with me, stay by my side, make me laugh until I cry, until the sunrise, until the sunrise.
promise you'll stay with me promise you'll never leave stay by my side make me laugh until i cry until the sun rise until the sun Jenny Mobile, to pa ma shirt well.